some uh, art, he would take like one hour to prepare the ink itself. But today, uh, time is uh, important, so we prepare some uh, liquid uh, ink, so he can uh, start like a height. So now he's going to light Yama, meaning it's mountain. But in uh, kanji, uh, we have uh, several types <coughs> of the same meanings. And then it also depends on how old the word is coming from. If it's like a new one, it's more like simplified. So he will uh, make an example, which is uh, like uh, from long time ago. Yeah, you can see it's mountain. <laughs> yeah. The mountain is uh, like, like by shape, so everybody can see it looks like a mountain. It's called Yama. So this is another uh, pattern of a uh, mountain called Ten Shotai. But still, you can see it's mountain. <laughs> we change several font. It's called Le Shotai. This is now in Japan currently using as mountain. So this is uh, to write quicker. For example, in English we have ABCD, but we can make it uh, like a faster way, so this is a similar uh, thinking. That's why it's really so nice. It's also nice to make some part is very black and thicker, and then it's a little bit like a less ink. That's also kind of art. <laughs> it's now still mountain, but <laughs> it's less ink. It's more like a black and called social type. Uh, now he's talking about the, this part, less ink, but he is trying to make difference of this type and this type is. Ko, ko, tsukau to, kona jou no, kona, kona jou te kana, fude ga ko, kore wa sen jou no kapitsu to kona jou no kapitsu de, ko fude o nejiru ka, ko wa te tsukau ka, waru ka, nejiru ka no jira. It uh, all depends on how you use the brush. Yeah. But this is a line, but this is like little dot. It's all technique how uh, he used the brush. So today we try Kaisho style, it's a font of the name. And then uh, the first step is when you put the brushes on the paper, 45 degrees to start. So like, put like Stop. Go. Yeah, this is the 